What's going on, everyone? This is your boy at It's Mosey, and I am super excited to also introduce your favorite brown boy, aka Naf. So we're here. What are we going to talk about today, Mo? Let's go. Okay, well, this is where you, we're going to be talking about, about all the exciting things that are happening on Web3, NFTs, crypto. But today, specifically, we're talking about the metaverse. Now, Tell me some exciting news about the metaverse. So just this past this this past week, Mr. Mark Zuckerberg announced, and we knew this was coming a few weeks ago. They finally changed Facebook's name to Meta, which of course stands for the metaverse. And you're seeing it right here live. And Mo, this is this is super exciting, bro. Uh, totally is because like I I was uh, not surprised by this. I was not surprised. I actually thought. Facebook was going to do something like this because it's like kind of an aging company. Yep. They've been in the news and the you know Congress, all that hot topic stuff. So a lot of like, you know, heavy things happening on them. So this move is actually a smart move. What do you think about that? I think so too. Just like if what Facebook wants to do is essentially try to own the metaverse, which people are in a little bit of outrage over, but at the end of the day, the metaverse is owned by all of us. So it's totally fine. And again, I'm excited because similar to what we've seen Gary Vee do with NFTs, Facebook is going to bring this extremely mainstream. And with the budget, the team, and everything they have behind them, I'm excited to see what the future is and what the future of the metaverse actually is going to become. Yeah, no, totally. And, and you know, I, I didn't watch I didn't watch the live stream, but like just seeing just seeing some of these images right here, like what do, what do you think about Dude. like what they're trying to? It's, it's, I feel like it's a, it really stems a lot from gaming. This is so underrated. Ready Player One is some. That's one of our favorite movies. Like, and look at what's happening live here. They're literally integrating that into everyday life. You could literally play with anyone around the world. Imagine. Look at what's happening here. Now, okay. My question to you is: Why is Facebook doing this? Like, from your perspective. So I, I gave my two reasons. Yeah. Do you have other suggestions and why? I think there could be a million reasons and answers to this, but at the end of the day, I think Mark and Facebook are extremely smart. And they're at the forefront of what's happening. They're seeing the change and the revolution with NFTs and crypto, but more importantly, yeah. with Web 3.0, which is exactly what this is. Totally. And exactly when you're a company like Facebook, why wouldn't you want it? You're already doing AR and VR. Totally. Why not own this space? Now, I totally agree with you. And this is kind of what you talk. So what, you, what you're talking about is something, the exciting part about it. I think this is actually an exciting move. And I can't wait for the next five years because this is going to, this is going to come in like heavy like on all of us and uh we're already seeing it in an nft space you know uh, i'm pretty sure all these different things that we're seeing here you can be buying your your you know your avatars and your uh your things it's, it's all going to be integrated into one space so i'm super bullish on this idea and i think it's only inevitable like it's pretty much the new the, the new revolution this <laughs> is it the future is coming the metaverse is here but let's ask, we want to ask you guys a question. What do you think? What do you think about the metaverse? Are you in it? Do you believe in it? Comment down below. Let us know what you think. Because if you're with me and Mo and you're bullish, I'm excited to jump in and start playing some games. 100%. Excited to, you know, see what people got to say. Exactly. All right. We'll catch you guys next one. Peace.